it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 13th so yeah we're just gonna see what comes up so what do we have for around the 13th Eight of Wands reverse right off the bat. So the Eight of Wands reversed is no communication, lack of communication, blocked, blocked communication, no messages coming in, something that about that um, stopped, something is stopped, not moving forward. There could be some jealousy issues here as well. Not ready, not ready. Somebody's not ready. They may be feeling guilty or something like that. They may, they may ha be feeling defeated. They probably are feeling defeated and they're quite not ready to communicate or something like that. Mm. Page of Cups, but a message is coming, okay? They're good. This is good news that is coming. Um... Get another card. Not ready, but good news is coming. Ooh, the star, the star reverse, losing hope. Fear, fear is in the way. We have somebody that has some sort of feelings, but they're not communicating because of fear. They're not communicating because of fear, but they do have feelings. You know, they're thinking about it. They are thinking about it. They're taking more time to think about it. Um, no faith. This is a test of faith. Now this could be thinking about an apology as well. Somebody, or they're thinking about communicating because a page of cups can be an apology. This could be uh, fearful of not being accepted or something like that. Hanged man, so definitely thinking. We definitely have an individual here that is thinking, thinking a lot. Struggling too. Struggling with their ego and that's why they haven't stepped forward yet. That's why they ha haven't communicated because their ego is in the way. This is ego. You know, they can't let it go. They can't let something go. And they're really, really struggling. They may have tried to punish somebody, you know. punished them in some way to so somebody who is struggling mentally with fear and ego they do have feelings but right now they're going through a period of enlightenment and they're thinking a lot they are thinking a lot the fear has taken over it could be fear of of getting uh, tied down okay somebody may be fearful of getting tied down um, the lovers okay so we have we have a perfect match here this is a uh, kindred spirits right the lovers is soulmates it's a perfect union um, but making a choice and there's consequences with your choice this is a card of consequences this is a healing love there's uh shared values, uh, there's some sort of deep attraction, this person, um, whoever it is that is, this person may be, they're confused, okay, they're confused, they're in a state of confusion right now. They definitely, whoever this person is, has some sort of admiration or feelings for an individual that uh, they're hiding, they are hiding their feelings, they're hiding them um, because of fear. And, and I think they're fearful that they will be rejected. They're fearful that they will be rejected. This is a, a soulmate uh, connection. There's a, there's, a, there's a sexual attraction as well. There's a very deep connection here. Uh, these two people can feel each other. They think about each other probably all the time. Um, this is a soulmate connection. But fear has um, paralyzed somebody 
has, has really stopped somebody from communicating or moving forward. This person is definitely thinking about it. They're thinking about the connection. They are. They probably know, too, that it is a soulmate connection. And that could be what brings on the fear because the connection is so strong. Okay, the connection is very, very, very strong. Um, this person, you know, knows that if they go down this path, there will be consequences because this is consequences. They're thinking about communicating right now. Oh my God, the tower reverse. They don't want to get themselves involved in any sort of false contracts, right? They're afraid to build a new foundation because in the past, you know, they haven't been able to keep any anything solid. That's why this person is so uh, scared to, to uh, open up. Um, extremely scared, extremely, extremely fearful, fearful of getting hung up on, on something that isn't real. We definitely have some fear here. The tower is a disaster. The tower reverses is, is extreme. We have, we have an individual that, uh, may be experiencing some sort of extreme internal dysfunction or disruption or disturbance within themselves this person is very much disturbed they are very uh disturbed with their in their thoughts over you know uh, a partner okay very 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 disturbed um really struggling struggling extremely really 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 struggling with their emotions they're they're trying to avoid building a foundation because they're they're afraid. They're afraid that you know if they get hung up on this person, they will be, uh, you know, it, it will be false. It won't be real. That's why there's so much fear here. Anyhow, um, this person, whoever this person is that has feelings, is is trying to avoid. A false contract they're trying to avoid getting themselves hurt and that's why they're avoiding it's like they're avoiding communicating but anyhow um, mm, it is extremely fearful anyhow um, the Sun reversed the high priestess reversed so somebody is choosing to be alone because they have there's poor logic there's delusion here they're not seeing clearly uh, very 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 confused uh, they may feel like they're not good enough uh, they might not have they may feel like they don't have enough to offer they're keeping to themselves they probably have a lot of self-doubt this whoever this person is um, has experienced some, a major loss in the past and now they don't trust there's extremely distrustful um, now the Sun reverse is unhappy sadness unhealthy and this is unhealthy and this is unhealthy so we have somebody here that's not healthy as well and I know that I'm changing the story but with unhealthy 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 so we have somebody here that isn't healthy they're not healthy and it could be an unhealthy mindset with the with the hangman. Okay, that could be a mindset. They're just not thinking clearly. Okay, they're letting negativity, negative thoughts or whatever get the best of them. There's been a broken commitment or a broken marriage that has caused this person to uh, shut down. Okay. But they do have feelings for somebody. They've, they've come across to somebody that they have deep feelings for. I know that they do. And there is an opportunity to build a new foundation. There is. But this individual that is so trapped in their thoughts, in their mind... And is struggling to let go of the uh, fear 
this person that is struggling to let go of the fear is really, really thinking negatively. But anyhow, there's, they're blocking a love connection. They are. They're blocking a love connection by not communicating. But anyhow, this is not happy. Uh, not very spiritual. Uh, this person is not very awakened. Definitely not very enlightened. Okay, they need to, they need to wake up. They definitely need to wake up. Um, there's there's going to be I feel like there's a chance for a reunion here okay I feel like there's a chance for a reunion somebody may be um, could happen suddenly all of a sudden maybe somebody gets some sort of epiphany and they do express their feelings hmm or they follow their heart. Somebody follows their heart after they have been ignoring it. They've been ignoring their gut. They've been ignoring the positive. They've been ignoring the light. And it's like, this is a very sudden. This is definitely all of a sudden. This could be a, a, a sudden attraction. Could even be a... Something is, is going on here, but anyway, I'm not going to say it, but this is definitely sudden. This is a deep attraction. Why is this happening? The star card is reversed is why. Why, 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 why? Why is this happening now? Somebody may be coming together with somebody that they never expected. You know, they weren't ready for it. They weren't ready for this connection. They weren't healed or whatever because this, whoops, is lack of healing. It is. The star reverses lack of healing. The sun reverses lack of healing. And this is not ready. Somebody wasn't ready for this person to come. And here they are. And that's why this, there's so much internal disruption. Okay? This is internal chaos. This is like, oh my God. Oh my God. Why is this happening to me now? I'm not ready for it. I'm not ready for it. Well, you know, universe is in control. The tower is a universe card. So there's definitely a love connection here that has brought in two people together that, you know, surprise, surprise, surprise. You didn't expect it. Here it is. You were totally unaware that it was going to happen at this time. Seven of Swords. One more. This is about using logic and reason. This person needs to, you know, and is trying to reason, trying to reason with their thoughts, trying to escape too, trying to escape their, their truth. This person wasn't even looking for it. This is not looking where, not looking where you were going, not looking for it and boom. And it is boom. Okay. Boom. Here it is falling in love or fell in love or perfect match whatever wasn't looking for it here it is oh there it is queen of wands reverse but there was somebody in the past we talked about this lately recently there was somebody in the past that um Hmm. Probably wasn't faithful. But anyhow, the Queen of Wands in reversed is lack of confidence, lack of willpower, lack of self esteem, low self esteem. Somebody here has some really low self esteem, may even have a self image problem. somebody has been lied to they have been lied to in the past which has caused them to not have any faith in relationships which is true right there's been some cheating there's been some cheating there was probably another woman or another man or something which caused another person a lot of uh Chaos, you know, internal chaos. Upset. It was a major upset. Now they weren't ready, but here it is. There's a new opportunity that is here. There is. It's a new opportunity. Ready or not.
nine of swords reversed so the nine of swords reversed is extremely worried extremely 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 worried so we have an individual here that is very very fearful worried about being cheated on worried about being deceived worried about building a foundation with anybody but has feelings for somebody else so anyway um the nine of swords reversed is uh Somebody may be even feeling guilty. They feel guilty or they feel ashamed for what they did. Somebody may have cheated, involved another woman, and they feel ashamed. And I, and I know that's probably for, I don't know if that's for everybody. But this is another woman. This has cheated. This is ashamed. This is ashamed. So somebody may be feeling ashamed that they caused all this chaos. They caused all this ruin. They ruined it because the, the tower in reverse is ruin. They ruined something. They may feel like they ruined something. They may, may be feeling like, why did I ruin it? Why did I ruin it? Why did I ruin this, this perfect match, this perfect connection? So somebody may be saying that. Um, this, is, this is having a hard time sleeping dreaming this person that has feelings is is really really uh staying up at night having a hard time sleeping and, and you know uh ignoring having a hard time ignoring their gut but has been ignoring their gut but is, is having a hard time doing so their intuition is definitely telling them to follow their heart but they're struggling because of their ego. With the hangman and the queen of wands reversed, those are both very egotistical. So somebody is struggling with their ego. There is definitely a soulmate connection here. Um, let's clarify that lover's card. There's a chance to build a new foundation. Oh, Knight of swords reversed. Ooh, so somebody was moving too fast. constantly on the move doesn't want responsibility we have we have an individual that um, is definitely fearful very 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 fearful in no hurry to uh, get into a commitment but it's here it's like the commitment is here it's like you take it or leave it the time is now it's now. Take it or leave it. So what is this person going to do? This person isn't communicating because of fear. They really are. Two of Swords reverse. That is exposure. That is coming out of denial. Unblocking. Unblocking. Opening up. Somebody is going to open up because I put I was clarifying the page of cups here. So they are going to open up. They're gonna open up, they're gonna they're gonna speak up, they're gonna they're gonna stop pretending. They've been indecisive, they've been procrastinating, they've had overwhelming fears and anxiety and stress and uh, they've been overly cautious and emotionally guarded and they've been detached and not communicating because they were protecting themselves. But this person, the Page of Cups, is good, happy news. Welcome news is coming. This person is going to follow their heart. Eight of Pentacles reversed. But I think they have some serious regrets over not putting in any effort. They probably have serious regrets. They're, they 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 not, they haven't been trying hard enough, or working hard enough, or not putting in effort. They they're fearful of giving up their independence too. They are. They're definitely the fear is great, great, huge. Queen of Swords, but we got the Queen of Swords here, who is very intelligent, very smart, very. Um, 
witty. She thinks very fast. She's very genuine. She's very authentic. She's very real. She knows the truth. She speaks the truth. She communicates. So this is a communication coming in. So that I believe there's going to be some communication coming. Man or woman. This is somebody that is thinking about it. They get a new perspective and they speak up. They don't hold back. Okay, they don't hold back communication, they speak up, so they go for it. So I do believe that some sort of communication is coming from an individual that has been thinking and thinking and thinking and thinking and they are going to communicate, they are. Um, now the Queen of Swords is, is somebody that will probably ask for the truth. She's going to ask questions. So and that's maybe another reason why this person hasn't communicated. Because the Queen of Swords, she has a lot of questions. Okay? She may say, you know, who have you been with? What have you been doing? That kind of thing. Uh, tell me everything. I want to know everything. You know, definitely that's the Queen of Swords. And she's, whoever this Queen of Swords is, could be a male or a female, is very forthright, very honest, very truthful. And she will accept, she or he, will accept nothing but the truth. We have a very independent individual here that has been living a very comfortable, independent life. <clears throat> and I think they have an opportunity for a partnership with somebody that is perfect for them. But giving up that independence is probably the biggest fear. If you are in a coupled relationship, this is about independence. Somebody may be speaking up and making a very painful, stressful decision to separate because there is somebody else here. This is a choice between two lovers. The lovers is a choice between two lovers. Okay? It is. And there's been some cheating. There has been. This person is professional and she knows the truth. So this is interesting. Somebody was in denial though. The two of swords reversed. That's denial. Somebody was in denial over the truth, but now they're waking up. They're waking up to the truth. They're seeing the truth. They're seeing the truth about some sort of deception or some sort of lies or maybe they were deceiving themselves. I mean, we could go all day. There's been some sort of, it could be self-deception. There's been some sort of self-deception here. There's been no moving forward. There's been a blockage of happiness, okay? There has. But there is a message coming from somebody that, and, it's, and that message is going to the person that they love. They're going to be communicating with the person that they feel the deep connection with. After not putting in any effort. And I think this person is going to have a hard time explaining themselves. But they're going to do it. Okay, they're going to. I think they're going to. But they're afraid. They're very, very, very much afraid. Not only are they afraid to explain, they're afraid of commitment. <laughs> they are. So anyway, um, if you're in a coupled relationship, you, something is going to be exposed with that two of swords reversed by an individual who has the information. This is somebody who has some sort of information and they are going to expose some lies, some cheating, some deception that you were unaware of. Because it says it's unaware. Lies being exposed about cheating or deception. You know. Somebody's not happy. They haven't been happy. With the person that they're with. Whoever they're with. they It's like they're not even attracted to this person. And they have somebody else. Maybe they've been watching this other person. They get caught. Somebody's getting caught. And it's going to cause major disruption in the home with that tower. The tower reversed. And this is a reveal. The two of swords reversed. There's going to be uh, 
disturbance on the home front or in the establishment for somebody because some sort of truth is going to be revealed that causes this disruption. Anyway, somebody's probably going to end up crying and throwing a fit with the Queen of Wands reversed. Why, why, why are you doing this? Why did you do that? Why did you get me involved when you were in love with her? Anyway, good luck.